Still to this day, analog tape is one of the most sought after and well respected recording mediums in the audio world. And for a good reason. The fast compression and saturation that you get out of analog tape is still unmatched. For this session we recorded one band in one take over a 24 channel multi-track tape machine. To capture the magic of tape, we used the new M32 Pro in combination with Total Mix FX. Hi again, we are back at the AAF studios and today we record the draw bars live in the room without any acoustic screens. We want to achieve a classic 60s vintage sound. So we use the tape machine as kind of a plug-in before we record into the DAW. The machine has three heads. First, we've got the delete head, which deletes music which was on tape before. Second, we've got the record head, which records the music to the tape. And last but not least, we've got the reproduction head, which plays the music back to the system. Between those two, there's a gap of approximately 20 milliseconds. During the sound check, we change from all input mode, which plays back the input of the tape machine, to all repro mode, which will play back the recorded material. Now the recorded material will be instantly sent to the total mix where we can set the levels and control after the tape. For the drums we use a main microphone, the Sennheiser MD441, pointing at the snare but trying to capture the whole set. For the bass drum, we need a supporting microphone to get a little more low end. We use the same Sennheiser MD441 for that application. Furthermore, we put up two AM25 ribbon mix in the Glen Johns position to be able to push the mids and to compress the whole set nicely. For the bass, we use a combination of a DI signal plus the amp mic with just an ordinary SM57. For the organ, we use a combination of two Sennheiser MD421s in stereo plus a AKG D12 for the bass. The two Sennheisers are picking up the rotating horn speaker. We pan them hard left and hard right to get a nice and rich stereo Doppler effect. The D12 is picking up the rotating bass and it's gonna be panned just in the middle. Mm -hmm. 